and I know that you will give me the redress that I seek from you. Morka and his people have insulted the dignity of Amachara. They have desecrated all the values of Amachara. They have given the impression that might is right and expect that we must work under their huge legs. I appeal to you gods of our forefathers. If I have done anything wrong as to deserve this, then I shall say it is your verdict. You have meted it out rightly, and I deserve to be punished. But if I have done nothing wrong by abiding by your principles, if I have done nothing wrong by upholding your values, if I have done nothing wrong by upholding the culture that has guided my people all these years, I entreat you, gods, revenge for me. I beseech you, gods, come to my aid. I entreat you, gods, avenge me. Avenge my daughter and fight for the rights of our people that I have always fought to uphold. I entreat you, gods of my fathers, do this for me. You're a trooper, right? Uh, yes, please. It's anything the matter. I was told that you're the next in line in the priestly family to become the chief priest following the death of the former, right? Uh, uh, yes, chief. It's okay. I came to offer you my congratulations. Uh, thank you, chief. <laughs> By my information, you will be ordained tomorrow. Uh, you are very correct, chief. You are very correct. That's why I'm here. I want us to do business. Business? Yes. I, I, chief, I don't... Uh, I don't so calm down. Our party. Yes, Chief. The bag. Calm down. <clears throat> Chuba. This bag contains the sum of one million naira. One million? It's yours. Eh? Who gave it to me? Me. The Iwai Danda gave it to you. Chuba, looking around here, I need no telling to know what this money can do in your life. But just as you have need for this money, I also have need for the throne of Amachara. Am I communicating? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Chief. Mm. That you want the throne of uh, Amacha. Good of Amacha. You, you, you are paying my way to the throne, yes. The Royal Council will soon visit the Oracle to know who should be named as the next Igwe. And by then, the gods should be speaking through you. I guess you want to be richer than you are now, eh? Hey? Use your position to give me what I want and I'll make you whatever you want to be. Good day, Chuba. Boys. Gods of our land, you're all that we have. Oh, hey. You're all that we have. Oh, You're all that we have. Yeah. Oh. You're all that we have. Yeah. Oh. You're all that we have. 
Don't let the wicked in this world override us. Like I was saying, Ichiazo, Amatara needs an Igwe. But the disagreement between us is denying our community that. I have come so that we can come to some compromise for the good of Amatara. I'm listening. My group and I have agreed on how the next ego of Amatara should be named. Let the Oracle perform its duty as usual. Good. The gods be praised. But that's on one condition. That we approve Ndoka and Deni as council members. I'll give it a thought so I can get back to you. Amata is waiting in Chazu. Good day. You're all that we have. Don't let the wicked in this world override us. We have served you so faithfully. For the time past, you have been there for us. Gods of our land, we beseech you. Fight for us. Fight for us. My elders, what seek the wise and the prudent in their board? Of the gods. We have come to seek the wisdom of the gods of our ancestors. Here are our consultation items. <laughs> the gods are all ears. Speak. Gods of our fathers, gods of our ancestors, you who appoint our kings and grant them long life, you in whose hands lies the destiny of our community, Amachara. We have come to find out from you who the successor to your late humble servant, Igwe Umunakwe, is. <laughs> you have had them, the guardian of my people. Speak! But they may be happy. No, who is going to be the next successor? My elders, the gods have chosen Chief Moka as next Igbo of Amajara. Choba, Choba, to distort the message of the gods is to court death. Choba, you are digging your own grave. Choba, 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 I have warned you. Let us go. <laughs> Be 
Ejiri, God of our ancestors, I greet you. You provide for our people in times of peace. You protect our people in times of war. You protected our forefathers. It is now time for you to protect us. I have lived my life upholding your values. Today I fight for the preservation of the sacredness of those values. But forces beyond me have conspired to desecrate those values. This forces me to destroy all that we hold dear, all that you have compelled us to uphold all these years. And at this point, I must say that as a mere mortal, I have done my utmost and I now entreat you to take over the battle from here. I have brought you the fruits of my labor from my farm in appreciation of what you have done for my people and what you did for our forefathers. Accept them, I entreat you, but make this fight yours from now on. I have done my utmost. God of our forefathers, I greet you again. Take over the fight. Hey, Jerry! The God of our life, the protector of our people, the protector of our my child. <laughs> that might come! <laughs> Speak to me! Speak to them so that they'll hear! Uh, I know what you want. And I'll give it to you, Ejiri. Ibuayidanda is a man of his words. Now, crown me. Ejiri, the time has come!
Ah, Chief, why are you back so soon? Where's the crown? It's still in the shrine. What about the chief priest? He's dead. Chief! Mm. So, dead? How did he die? However he may have died, the fact remains that with his death, the coronation has been shifted until the gods select another chief priest. You must be joking, Ichazu. You must be joking. No sane person jokes with an abomination, which is what the death of the chief priest on your coronation day is. An abomination, Chief Morka. Whatever. But I must be crowned today. Today. The gods have just said a resounding no to that. And I, the Bwani Danda, will give them a resounding rejection of their decision today. Uh. Mm. Uh, as a traditional prime minister, our culture confers on you the right to present the Igwe to the people after the priest has crowned them. Or to crown him by yourself in the absence of the priest. I will not consciously incur the wrath of the gods. I will do no such thing. Ichazo! Ichazu! Abo Panda. Abo Panda. Chief, I'm afraid we have to postpone this coronation. What will I tell my friends and the people of Amatara, waiting at the village square, for me to be presented to the Manigwe? What do I tell them? We, uh, we have no choice, Chief. We have no choice. Hey, this situation has become the proverbial sesa fly on a man's crot. Leave it and it will suck you to death. Smite it and risk busting the testes as well. For me, I am going to kill the sesa fly. How, Chief? Wait for me here, all of you. I am going to get the crown. And when I return, I shall appoint another traditional prime minister from among you who will present me to the people. My people are with you. The coronation day was a day like no other day in our town, Amachara. Yeah. Mm -hmm. At least, the state governor and some federal ministers got to know about our town, Amachara. Hey. 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 The coronation was not only unique because of their presence, mm -hmm. but more importantly, for the first time in the history of our town, Amachara, a round peg was put in a round hole in our royal chronology. Yes, sir. Oh! Yes, sir. Oh! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There are kings, but there are kings. Oh, yes, My people, I greet you. Thank you. Amachara Kwenu. Amachara Kwenu. Amachara Kwenu. Amachara Kwenu. Amachara My people, I want to tell you that we have crossed all the obstacles on our way to progress. Oh, yes. And Amachara will never be the same again. Ever.
If I had another land, your highness, I would not have been so bothered. But that land is the only inheritance from my late father. And my family lives off it. Igwe. Please, please help me beg Ben to leave my land for me. Is that all? Young man, did you hear that? Yes, Your Highness. What have you to say to that? Igwe Ndiche, I greet you. I guess I need no further introduction to you all. I came back from the United States of America one month ago with a single aim that is to help develop Amachara village. After carrying out a comprehensive <coughs> feasibility study, I have decided to build a factory in Amachara. But the only site that is suitable for this gigantic project is the land in question. Personally, I don't see anything wrong in telling Ogene to relinquish ownership of land to me. Yes! My people, I want you to look beyond ownership tussle to what the people stand to gain if I build my factory. Because if Ogene succeeds in stopping me, if he succeeds in stopping me, then I have no choice than to relocate my factory to my maternal village. Thank you. Did you offer any monetary gift to Ogene? Yes, Your Highness. To the tune of two million naira. Apo. Two million naira. Apo or panda? Apo or panda? Okay, then. Igwe. Why did you refuse the offer? Igwe. Selling that land is the most dishonorable thing. It means selling my own birthright. No amount of money can induce me to do it. And I told him, what do you do on that land? He went, I farm on the land. Okay then. How many people of Amachara have you employed since you started farming on that land? He went, I farm on subsistence level and employ nobody. <coughs> ben, how many people do you intend to employ when the factory is finished? Your Highness, I will employ so many people, at least 50 indigenous of Amata. <sighs> then it's settled. Make no payments to anyone. By my royal decree, I hereby give you the land to build your factory. This is my judgment. Hey! As I told you earlier, my family and I depend 
only on that piece of land for survival. The implication of this injustice is that we have been made destitute overnight. Please, save me from such ordeal, Ichiazu. Prevail on the Igwe to reverse his judgment, please. Uh, Ogeme, honestly, I sympathize with you in all sincerity. In this situation, there is absolutely nothing I can do about it. Nothing. Look, I, I wish I could, but I can't. <laughs> but you are the traditional Prime Minister of Amachara. Yes, I am. But for as long as that imposter, Moka, remains on that seat, you will never see me anywhere near the palace. No. Did you see me at the last council meeting? No. Good. I won't go there. No, I won't. But what do you suggest that I do? Hmm. I suggest you take your case to the gods. The gods will give you justice. They are not like us mortals who are corruptible. They are just. They are fair. I think the gods will handle your case properly. Take heart, eh? Okay, eh? I believe the gods will give you a solution to this problem. Ngene? Ngene? Ngene! Who stood on the ground and touched the sky? You in whose hands justice rests. Fight for me. Fight for me. Give the downtrodden before you. A voice I beseech you. Ngende, Ngende, Ngende. Oh, fight for me, Gede! Fight! 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 Fight for the damn dragon! I know you will do it for me! I know you will do it for me! Oh! 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 Oh, oh Hey! 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 What are you doing? Are you deaf? I want to hear that you go collecting this whole land from again. I get from you. Now, and the count of three, I want you to leave here. Come on, get out of this place now. I said you should get out of this place. Get out! <laughs> We appealed to his wisdom. We played on his emotion. But your highness, he was quite resolute in his decision. What is the implication? The implication is that we have an idol prime minister. And that's a bad omen for us. That could well explain the mysterious state in our match recently, your highness. Then I will have none of it. 
I have respected Ichiazu enough by not going ahead to appoint a new traditional prime minister on my coronation day like I threatened. Whatever he thinks he is, Amacha is bigger than him. Yes. Yes. How much bigger? I hereby appoint Ichiedima oh. as the new traditional prime minister of Amacha. Yes. Fine, man. He feels so fine, my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> no more. Go, go, go.
You nearly killed me at the village square a while ago. Again? Again? Eh? But some boys helped me when I tried to run. The money is that I tell them what I know about that woman's madness. In eh? this amateur. In this amateur. In fact, it took the intervention of our worst enemy each year for them to release me. Igwe, how long will this go on? Eh? Not anymore. Not anymore. This has gone on for more than a week, and that's more than enough. Igwe, what do we do to prevent this woman from exposing us? Huh? Boys, Igwe, you heard him. Yes, yes sir. sir. You know what to do. This night, meet John. Igwe. Igwe. Your Highness, in the past one week, we have known everything but peace. All our goods died in one day. Our farms were gutted by fire the same day. And we woke up this morning to find our wife very, very sick at the point of death. Is that why you came and called me off my bed? Do I look like a doctor? Your Highness, we have consulted the Oracle. And you said it was due to the money we collected from you three months ago to oppose Ichiya as well. But this is the beginning of a shot up. God, he will take this buffoon out of my company. Ah, come on. Ah, oh. 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 Why is that so? Oh. 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 I'm...
Yes. As I was saying, not even after we have told His Highness everything, did he make any attempt to help us. Rather, he chased us away as if we are also. Please help us, Olo. His Highness refused to help you. Then there's nothing I can do. Nothing. Oh no, you are our last hope. Please, please, please help us. Please, Olo. All right. Um, look, this this is a very serious issue. Huh? Okay. You will summon the entire amateur community. Tell them the truth. Confess to them. Ask for their forgiveness. Apologize for everything that has happened. You can do that, can't you? Oh no, this will be very shameful. Is there no other way of doing it? Okay. Um, go to Chief Morka. Give him back all the money he has given to you. Wash your hands of Chief Morka and all his activities. I think that way the gods may just restore your peace. We, we have used up the whole money. I see. Then you have used up all your peace. I can't help you. The gods can't help you either. You can go now. Please. There's nothing I can do for you. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I'm sorry for you people. I've never been so beaten all my life. My entire body is on painful fire as I'm talking to you. Nduka. Your Highness. Why did you beat up my traditional Prime Minister? Why? Your Highness, I did not know what I was doing when I beat him. Uh, I, I, I was possessed, possessed by, by who? You glorified it, you're possessed by who? 
You have the guts to beat up my prime minister and stand there and tell me you were possessed by... Who possessed you? No, tell me! Tell me who you're possessed! Calm down, your highness. Calm down. Calm down. I know a person behind all this rubbish. I know him. Is this a joke or something? It's only a fool that will joke with this kind of situation. It's here as though it's behind all the dirt and negative occurrences in this Sabatana and Amachara, including what happens today. It's here as It's here as Yes. It's here as is very diabolical. It's here as is plotting your downfall. It's here as is plotting for you to be disgraced and possibly turn the people against us. Hmm? It's how to discredit you. You have been exposed. All the evil you committed against the Igwe and council members to get them discredited has been exposed. Not even the gods can save you from my wrath today. Morker, you are daring the gods. Abba Panda. You are daring the gods. I warn you, Morker, you are daring the gods. Abba Panda. Let me see you and your so called gods in action then. Gods! Force this fool to sit on the floor. Your Highness, uh, that's it, a taboo. A titled man does not sit on the bare floor. That is precisely why I want him to do that. So that he and his so called gods will know that I, the boy in Danda, the Igwe of Amachara, put no opposition whatsoever. Gods! Your Highness! You have been exposed. All the evil you committed against the Igwe and council members to get them discredited has been exposed. Not even the gods can save you from my wrath today. Morka, you are daring the gods. Abobanda. You are daring the gods. I warn you, Morka, you are daring the gods. Abobanda. Let me see you and your so-called gods in action then. Gods! Force this fool to sit on the floor. Your Highness, uh, that's it, a taboo. A titled man does not sit on the bare floor. That is precisely why I want him to do that. So that he and his so-called gods will know that I, the boy in Danda, the Igwe of Amachara, put no opposition whatsoever. Gods! Your Highness! Iyadeliaba. Ikwada Manonya. Agwada Tumbe.
Chen Ndoka. Honestly, I think His Highness went too far in the Chiazo's house the last time. This is not what we expected when we supported him to be the way of Amachara. Ndoka. My mind tells me that we are doomed men already. Hey! Me? Why do you say such a terrible thing? Does any of us need to be told that by collecting money from Chief Moka to support his discretion of our culture, that we have sold our conscience to the devil and beat our tents? Who are you? What did this to you? <laughs> Igwe, the bottom line is that Ndoka and Enyi and some other villagers who talked to the mysterious boy became deaf and dumb. Yeah. As you see them, they are deaf and dumb. They can't talk, they can't hear. Huh? You mean that these two can no longer talk? Or hear? Yes! Hey! Two of you, tell the Igwe your situation. <laughs> you see it? Oh, oh. They can't talk, they can't hear. My goodness. Huh? Well, I can't help them. Huh? As you can see, I am only an Igwe and not a doctor. Hey. Okay, Igwe, let me suggest that we do something to appease the gods because to leave them in this situation. Eh? I said go. Leave my palace! Go! Get out of this palace! Let's go. Move. 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 Fools. Idiots. Every little thing they run to the palace to come there. Am I a doctor? for taking their lives last night. Theirs was a very humiliating ordeal. And if I were in their shoes, I would have towed the same line. Talking about towing the same line, am I really safe? If the gods could so disgrace those who did almost nothing in the whole plot, what fate awaits me? Should I tell the people? No. 
that will mean erasing every honor I still have, even after my death. I can't do that. Let the worst come. I am ready. Panda. Abu Panda. This tent you about. Did, did you pass excreta on your cloth? They struck me with body order. Please help me. Go, go, go. Just go, go, go. Get out of my class. Go, go, go. Just get out. Will you help me? Go, go, go.
Stand up, stand up. Come on, stand up. Get up, get up. What is the problem? <coughs> yeah. The cheer. Evil is on the loose and <coughs> someone has to confront it. You are the only one who can do that. The cheer, please save our matter. Please. Nay. You are a man of great integrity. The gods always listen to you. Oh no. How many more people will die before you do something to save Amachara? Eh? Well, first of all, you people did the right thing by returning to Chief Morka the money you collected from him. This calamity has befallen our people because the land has been desecrated and the gods are angry. And until the anger of the gods runs its full course, Amatira will know no peace. But I want you people to go home assured that peace will return to Amatira. But that will be only after the gods have finished their fight. You can go now. Thank you. Thank you.
Why do I wake up every morning in this place? Who could be carrying me from my bedroom to this place every night in my sleep? This shrine. If this is a ploy by whoever is responsible to make me forget the throne of Amajara, then that person is mistaken. Because that throne is my life. I, the Buani Tanda, will never forget that throne for anybody. Not even the gods. I beg you, save me from this torment. I beg you in the name of your late father. Ah! Ah! Just I beg you. See, they are flogging me to death. Ah! They are flogging me to death. Save me. I 
secret. is happy you're back. Uh, Our thanks go to the benevolent gods. Yes, you see, the gods fought a very impressive battle. Yes. And left us with victory, but without a voice. That's the problem. Who speaks for us from now on? They didn't tell us. That question is to be answered by the gods. Mm. Hmm? Thank God that we now have a new chief priest um, in the person of uh, DK. Mm. Yes. Yeah. I think that's all we need. Mm, that's true. That means that uh, tomorrow we'll go to see the chief priest. Mm? Yeah. Yes, we'll go to the shrine of a jury. I agree. Let's uh, yes. know whom they have chosen to occupy the seat and run the affairs of our children. <laughs> it's okay, Jack. What is the dono? I know he's not feeling well at all. He's not feeling well. He said that if by tomorrow morning he's not able to make it, we should go ahead with other elders to the shrine. Yes, yes. He's not feeling well at all. He's not feeling well. He said that if by tomorrow morning he's not able to make it, we should go ahead with other elders to the shrine. He's prepared to abide by whatever the oracle says. I hope the condition is not all that serious. I am not so serious, but let us go. Hey, Jerry! Bala bubu ukwaju na abo ebi abo. Bala bubu ukwaju na abo ebi abo. Ebo ne mene numo no biyo nana. Bonica, 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 but any now will be the good. I have done that. 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 I have
Ah. Why are you bowing down to me, AJ, man? Hey, Lilia. Please, you are wanted in our match right now. It is very urgent. Very urgent. Urgent? Hmm, urgent. Is my father there? Have they killed him too? Hey, Lilia. Don't worry. Your father is alive. Let's just go. All right. Is it my mother? Can somebody talk to me? Oh, what is going on? Explain later. Everything is okay. You are one that I talk in a match around now. Let's go. No you problem. You me to feel comfortable. Yeah, you're not mad on the table. You're not mad on the table. Let's go. 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 Hey, in there. Welcome. I greet you, my elders. Why is everybody standing here? Where is my father? My father is inside. Let us see him. Come on, go inside, let's see. Yes. Ajuri 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 
e ma lori le blogu di be goro na mo je na gbaka atuko di bi ozu nwa ana ana si na won obogoli gana no won obogoli gana no obe kesi no ka di be ju no ni no nye gbo le ansi e ma na je mi igbo ka ji bu mi be je kala na ma koloni ni sawa kuko ejiri asi no si banko ka ja mo nye nka ajabara ba na ku efu o me akwa okuku adu mama ku ba okwa isi me me be odu kwa nko na adu mbulavi me na aslo ranli odu nko na adu mbulavi me na aslo ranli oke cha lagwo oke cha lagwo oke cha lagwo no lu mburike je le ebune o le mburike je le ebune oko do ko si me ejiri ha ike tu gola planya igiri go ogu o je ka obulu asu na egbu cheta gbara tangbara ta ma wo sali onye mubi egbu che gbara tangbara ta ma wo sali onye mubi o je ka obulu mo mo gidi a ka me isi na ebu gidi na ebu gidi isi na ebu gidi blog dogi da ka ko nyu isi na ebu gidi na ebu gidi nka de blog di blog dogi da ko ko nyu isi na ebu gidi blog di nka de blog di blog dogi da ko ko nyu o je ya bu o je ga bu o je ga bu Let me have your palms. Your two hands stretched. Okay, we do. We do not see a lot. Okay, we do. I want to nigu. Okay, we do. Okay, we do. I want to nigu. I don't know the anya. I don't know the anya. So I don't know. I don't know man eke. I don't know man oye. I don't know man abo. Tolo mana o po. Ah. Ah. Ele foi calem. Shake it. Rich lawyer. Ta! Ubun Babu. Let you go lazy, Gabez. Let you go lazy, Gabez. Hey, Jury. I walk with Adam Mamakuba. Where's your bank account, Monica? Mas já balbá não é fruco me, a boca não é luraje. Cabo fo, o que não é agora o dia para tosno o dia fo, o que é o dia para tosno o dia fo, mas fo moinha dia, porque não fo que ele já wana. O que Eza do Roma, ngembo ngenda machara. Moni eza do Roma.